All right, hello everybody. <clears throat> hello everybody out there. Tonight we're going to do a, uh, just a quick video. We're gonna do an unboxing um, of a mod that we just got. It just got delivered to the doors. So we're really excited about it. Um, <clears throat> just a little bit of an update. Uh, um, first of all, there's Gage. Say hello, Gage. Hello. And there's Athena snooping around the garage. Um, the Camaro is not in the garage. We actually have the Infinity in the garage today. Not sure why, but it's in here. Um, so anyways, let me turn this around. So a little bit update on the car. So I took the car in last week, Gage and I, and we had, um, we had the, uh, res we, we did a resonator delete on the car. And um, it sounds good, but the car feels a little different. It almost feels like, um, uh, like I lost uh, torque. I lost some torque and we, Gage and I did a bunch of research over the last uh, five days because it's been five days since we did the muffler delete and um, uh, not the muffler delete, the resonator delete. And we did a lot of research on the, on the Camaro forums. It says it does not recommend a resonator delete without an H pipe or an X pipe because with the L99 motor, you can lose uh, low end torque. And they're absolutely right. We did lose low end torque. I can feel it. It sounds great. And, but even with that though, it's kind of got, the Camaro kind of sounds like a, what does it sound like, Gage, that we had said? Uh, it sounds like a Mopar. It sounds like, it sounds like a Hemi for some reason. It sounds like a Hemi and I don't really like that. So it's kind of got that little bit of that chopper, that kind of like a chopper sound when you hit like 3,000, 4,000 RPMs. Um, so we, we, we read up, we did a lot of, uh, of research on that as well. And it says that once you get the X pipe on, that the chopper sound will go away. And, um, and also, you have to have the X-pipe or the H-pipe because with the L99 motor and even, even an LS1, the, you gotta, you, what the X-pipe will do is it will allow even pulses when, you're, when your exhaust system, when your engine is pushing out that exhaust. It evenly creates pul pulses, which uh, obviously makes the, it makes the car run smoother. Your, it allows your, in, engine, your pistons to be a more of an even pace when they're going up and down. Um, and another thing is that you, you, know, you have to have that H-pipe and that X-pipe so that um, you have, a, you have a combustion. Um, I know a lot of people run straight pipes um, on, their, on their SSs, and, and it's not a bad thing, but I'm just, I keep reading article after article that says that you, you, you shouldn't do that. So we are taking the car in tomorrow. And I'm going to have the X-Pipe put on them. We're not going to do it here in the garage because um, the, the shop that, I've been, that I took the car to to do the resonator delete, I mean, they're just great with me. So, um, and, and, and they got the lift. And we, we, don't have our, we don't have our scissor jack yet. So I'm going to take it over there tomorrow. Tomorrow, tonight is just an unboxing. And then tomorrow, um, before I take it, I'll do an exhaust, uh, a little bit of a rev for you guys. You guys can hear the, the uh, startup. And then once we get the X-Pipe on, we'll do the same thing. So Gage is going to go ahead and, and un, unbox everything that we got here. Go ahead and start unboxing, Gage. It's a bigger package than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, and by the way, this is, um, uh, we ordered a Summit X-Pipe. Athena wants to know what's going on there. So we ordered the Summit X-Pipe. Um, so, did, you know, it, did, a lot, did a lot of research on it, and everybody seems to be pretty happy with it. So we, that's what we got, this is the Summit X-Pipe. Um, I'm gonna take it tomorrow after work um, and get it installed. What do we got in there, Mage? Oh, that's heavy. You want me to get it and you record it? Those are the clamps. Oh, and by the way, we're not gonna use the clamps. We are going to, I'm gonna have them uh, do uh, spot welds on it. Um, I just, uh, I mean, it's gonna be permanent. So I'll have them spot weld it, tack it, and then, uh, you know, if I don't like it, I'll just have them cut it and, and if we go do something different, but. Um, we are not going to use the clamps. So what else we got in there, Gage? Um, let's see. That is in everything here. <laughs> Alright, so there's the X pipe. You want me to pull it out? Yeah. Here. Right, it's here, guys. Okay, turn it around. Alright. So here we got the X pipe from uh, Summit Racing. Um, this is what will be going on the car. I'm pretty excited about that. I'm actually very excited about that. I don't know so much if I like the way they welded this, but I mean the welds look good. It's just yeah. it's obviously really dark. I mean, I mean that's not a bad thing, but and this is pretty heavy. Not as heavy as the resonator was, but it's interesting. You look in the X pipe and, and you wonder, God, I mean, can this really help your car? 
Um, you know, all the obviously everybody that's watching this channel, um, most of uh, this is usually a very typical part that you'd want to put on the car. Um, the H pipe, all the research we did was the H pipe pipe was going to give us a, a more low end torque and kind of a deeper growl. Um, the X pipe was going to be a little bit more exotic in sound and will give you some top end. Um, the SS has pretty good torque, so I'm not too too worried about really gaining any torque, any much more torque, but the Xbox will give us some torque. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing, to hearing what it sounds like with this on. I'm looking forward to seeing if I can fill it in the, in the horsepower butt monitor once it goes <laughs> on to see if we feel any difference. Um, let's see what else is in there. Alright. Uh, so I think... More think clamps. Just the rest of the clamps. Yeah, it's just all the clamps. Just all the clamps and then uh, um, it comes with directions, but we're not, we're not gonna need that because like I said, I am not using the clamps. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this welded, spot welded on. So anyways, that's it, clamps and an X-pipe. Um, so you know, this, this will be put on tomorrow after I get, get off work. Um, we're uh, gonna take the car in and have them install this thing. Um, and then I'll get some sound clips I'll get some sound clips and um, and I'll let you guys know if I if the old butt horsepower monitor feels anything different. Um, you know we're not going to get 50 horsepower from this thing, but um, with an X pipe they say you can get anywhere from 10 to 12 to 15 horsepower. So hopefully we'll we'll at least, hopefully I'll at least get back the low end torque that I lost, and I think it's definitely going to get rid of the sound, the chopper sound that we got. Everybody that's heard the car since we got the resonator uh, the. The resonator delete. resonator delete loves it. Our neighbor loves it, which you wouldn't think our neighbor would, but he loves it. Um, you know, a couple people that at work have heard it. Um, several of our neighbors, they, I mean, they came over right away once we got it done. They could all hear the difference. And I mean, it sounds pretty freaking good without the resonator, but uh, just not, I need it more refined. Um, and hopefully this uh, X pipe tomorrow will do that. So um, that's all we have. Gage, do you have anything? Um, Let me turn this around. No. Um, you have anything you excited about it? Oh yeah, um, uh, I, sh I mean, we bought a Camaro for because we like the Camaro. And we didn't buy a Camaro to hear a Mopar. Yeah, because it does kind of sound to me, guys. To me, guys, um, it sounds like the Dukes of Hazards car um, without the resonator, without an X pipe. It, that old, the, if you guys go back and watch any of the Dukes of Hazards shows, that whoa, and it's like a chopper sound. That's kind of the sound it got, and I'm not too thrilled with it. So. Um, hopefully this X pipe will really change that um, and also get some low-end torque. So anyways guys That's all we have. Dina, you have anything to say? No, you're just walking around the garage Looking for something squirrel 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 <laughs> All right, God God bless you guys and uh, we'll do uh, we'll upload this tonight and then um Actually, I'm gonna save it and then we'll uh, we'll do the I'll uh, do some some uh, tape recording over at uh, the shop when they put the X pipe on and then um and then tomorrow I'll do a, a rev without it and then a rev and an idle with it so you guys can hear the difference. So God bless. What do you want to close up with? Do? Uh, make sure you guys subscribe and like the video. Okay, perfect. I always forget to subscribe and like the video. So, all right, guys. Um, I will upload this probably tomorrow night after we put the X-Pipe on. God bless and uh, we'll see you soon. Oh. So we are over at the muffler shop today. We're getting uh, the X pipe put on the Summit X pipe from Summit Racing, and um, it's gonna take too long to put it on. And then uh, later on today, I will put on uh, do some revs and see that from here. So fingers crossed, we gain some torque, and it takes away the chopper sound and noise that it has on the exhaust. Good afternoon, Gagey. Oh, hi. All right, so Gage and I are, um, it's uh, in the evening here. Right before it gets dark, we actually had uh, the X-Pipe put on the car. And we're going to do a little startup and then go for a little drive. My audio isn't that good, but we'll give it the best that we can with what we're using. So. Hold on, guys.
All right, Gage. So what we're doing right now is uh, we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go, and obviously, I don't do over the speed limit with Gage in the car. And um, so I'm gonna do a pull from zero to 45 as a speed limit, so you can just at least hear it. So um, we got the windows down, and we'll go just from zero 45, and then. Um, and then we're gonna go over to the park by the house to do the rev because I don't want to do it in our neighborhood. I mean, everybody is at home on Friday evening and relaxing. So, but I would like for you guys to hear it. Um, and then uh, tonight I'll upload the video. So, what what are your thoughts on a gauge? Uh, the car. I like it a lot more with the X pipe than would it when it had the okay. resonator delete. Uh, one, two, three, four on five. Besides me really opening up this thing past over the speed limit, and I don't want to do that. So, um, but it sounds really good. So, tell us what your thoughts are, Gage. Uh, I, I like it a lot more. It sounds just more refined, more clean, kind of like fil filtered, kind of. If that makes sense. Because before it had like, a, like, a, like that kind of that rumble. Chopper, yeah, chopper. the Hemi. Yeah, like kind of like a Mopar or Hemi, and uh, I think it sounds. Like the Camaro, I think it sounds better with this X pipe. So yeah, we'll see you guys at the park. All right, everybody. So we're at the park, and um, we are going to Gage and I are going to do the uh, three rev. Um, so I'll do the rev. Gage is going to get off. And that way you guys can hear. It. I'm going to have him stand back a little bit because I think our audio will not pick it up if we're too close. And I really want you guys to get a um, to be able to hear what it sounds like. So okay, Gage. So on the count of three, you tell me when when you get out. And then like maybe 10 feet from the car. It's about 10 feet? Yeah. so deep and it sounds clean and it sounds refined and you gotta point it at me <laughs> uh, I dropped my phone oh, okay all right go ahead you got it so how do you think it sounds uh, I like it yeah I like it too so um, again tonight we'll upload this video um, Gage and I are gonna go um, respectively play a little bit in the car obviously obviously we we don't speed and I wouldn't speed with Gage because I don't want to be a bad influence so um, but we do like to rev it when we get to a stoplight one, once or twice. So that is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go play with the sound of the car. Ready? Thumbs up, baby. Okay, see you guys in a while. Thanks a lot.